Carolyn and Stephen, this raid lasted for several hours at this home here on Cherry Lawn, just behind me. Michigan State Police served a search warrant, and now this relative could be in big trouble. It was a raid that lasted here at this home for hours. Michigan State Police were removing potential evidence from the house. The state attorney general's office won't comment on the investigation or the raid. However, court documents obtained by Action News last summer show this is the home of Nika Cheeks, former mayor Kwame Kilpatrick's cousin. In the court documents, Cheeks is accused in a civil suit by then attorney general Mike Cox of siphoning off money from the Manoogian Mansion Restoration Fund. The fund is supposed to be used for upkeep and restoration of Detroit's official mayoral residence. The suit accuses Cheeks of using cash from the fund for her own personal gain. Among the listed expenditures, payments to a jewelry store, a bridal company, and a Florida-based golf academy. All told, it's alleged $25,000 was taken by Cheeks. Kilpatrick's cousin apparently had unchecked access to the Manoogian Restoration Fund while she worked in his administration. Cheeks was held in in default back in the fall for not making a court appearance in connection with the case and it would appear she remains in default and is facing tens of thousands of dollars in fines. At this point, the case remains a civil case. No arrests were made today. And just seconds ago, you can see here a relative of Kwame Kilpatrick, who had just identified himself as a relative of Kwame Kilpatrick, says that Michigan State Police had the wrong house. He says nothing was taken from here, but he would not come on camera. Reporting live on the West Side, I'm Tom Waite, Channel 7 Action News.